but I'm back for day two of Vlogmas and Advent, and I'm gonna show you my Target haul. We moved a few days ago. If you don't normally watch my um, videos, I teach sewing um, as a rule, but we had a big move in the middle of it, and we moved the day after Thanksgiving. So I've been just trying to get my house set up. We've been completely remodeling um, the kitchen and other areas. So it's been a little bit insane. So I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to accomplish this whole Vlogmas thing, but I'm just thrilled that I'm getting day two filmed and ready to go up. So I'm going to open both my advent calendars and then I'm gonna show you my target haul. I actually got out of the house and went somewhere and um, bought a few things, which I really needed. So we're gonna open day two of the chiz. See if I can get in there. And it's a Gouda. They all look the same. They're just little packets. So I have a Gouda cheese. And then let's see what coffee they gave me. Yesterday I tried it black and I may do that again. Um, but I may go ahead and put a little cream in it first. Yesterday it was apple pie. And today it is stuck. Big Island. We'll see. I'm going to go make up my little snack real quick and I'll have it and I'll show you my Target haul. I tried Big Sky Black off camera before I put my cream in it and it's very smooth and it's not very bitter at all. So yummy. Also, I forgot to say this yesterday, but these cups are at my Teespring shop, which you can get at the link in the bio if you want a cute sewing mug or, um, or t-shirt. And then we have the Gouda. And we have a peachy right here. This is a cute little Airedale Terrier. <laughs> I'm eating snacks, aren't I? Mmm, you know, paw. I know, we want some snacks. Okay, I'm gonna put this up here where she can't snag it. Mmm, -mm. love the cheese. It's gone, look, oh God. I'm not gonna show you the boring things like the shampoo and the batteries <laughs> that I bought. I'll show you some more of the fun things. And the first thing is this, it's an actual planter and it has a little plug hole in the bottom, it's only $3 and it has little snowflakes. I really have a thing for snowflakes. I love them a lot and you'll see I got more snowflake things. But this is a cute little planter, but I think what I'm gonna do is put it on the counter and put, um, like if we do a buffet, I can put silverware in it, something like that. I, that's what I bought it for, but it would make a great little planter too. You could also set a candle down in it. I just really liked it. I'm kind of regretting I didn't get more than one. So I got that cute little thing. I got more snowflakes. These are wrapping papers. Um, I'm doing a lot of pink and pastel-y type things for Christmas this year. And so this is a bluey silver snowflake. And then this other one is pink. It's a white background with pink and sort of a lavender and silver snowflake on it. So I got those wrapping papers. And to go with it, they have some really cute little gift tags. So the wrapping papers were $5. The gift tags were, I, I'm telling you, a, a lot of $5 things. This was also $5. That's just sort of how they price it. I got this giant spatula. It's, they say it's for cookies. Here's Spritz cookies right here, which is one of my family favorites that I grew up with. But I just needed a really good, wide, super sharp edged spatula. This is good for other things than cookies, like flipping pancakes, for instance, or um, anything delicate, like a piece of, uh, fish filet, something like that for a, a Teflon type pan. So that I bought this just for that reason. And I don't even know how much this was. I think it was like $4. It was in the Christmas section where the Christmas um, cookies and candies and stocking stuffers and stuff like that, that's where this was hanging. But it's a good find for me. I've been wanting one. I got this cute shirt just because I wanted something cheery and holiday-ish and now that we're back in Oklahoma it's we were in Kansas it's warmer here and I love it um, but I don't need as heavy a clothes uh, for sure it's usually 70 75 right now in December for kind of an average at least this year it is so I'll probably be getting some good use out of that cute little jingle jingle t-shirt 10 bucks and I got these really pretty hair clips um, they're just, they're a type, they're two different kinds of barrettes. They're a moon and a star. Look at the moon. I don't know if you can see. Can you see it? Sometimes with the face. I'm going to put it in my hair. There's a moon. And they're kind of big, which is good because they have a lot of hair. 
a moon and a star. And the star kind of looks like a snowflake. Look at the star, very pretty. Yay, I just wanted some sparkly hair things for me. And then the rest, I have a bunch of candles and these baskets. When we moved, we got rid of a lot of furniture that we didn't love and didn't want to move it because we didn't love it. And one of the things we got rid of was all of our dressers and nightstands. Um, we bought them because we desperately needed something, but we they were not what we wanted and we really couldn't find what we wanted. So we just sort of settled and we've been living with them for like 10 years. So we have no dresser or nightstand. Uh, we, have a one, we have one nightstand for the two of us. It's on my side of the bed and it's way too short for the bed and everything else. It's just not very practical. So we're looking for furniture. I was really hoping to hit some estate sales and some things like that. There's not a lot this time of year. So I bought these big baskets. Sorry, I bought these big baskets just to set in the closet that we could put our underwear and socks in, um, which are the things that were in the dressers that are the heart. We can't really hang underwear and socks easily. T-shirts you can hang up, a lot of other things you can hang up, but these, um, those need a basket. So that's what these baskets are for. And then I have a lot of these candles. These are Holly Jolly Berry and they smell awesome. They're $3. And these are going in Christmas stockings. So I have four of those for stockings. I also got First Snowfall for me, and look at the cute little container it's in. I got um, Sugared Peppermint, that one's for me. Um, I got me a Holly Jolly Berry also. I got Sugared Balsam. I like these, these smell like Christmas tree. I really like the fur scent. And this one is Festive um, Pine and Punch. And it definitely has the um, the smell of like a pine tree, but it also has a little something else, a little sweet, maybe like a little bit of cranberry or something with it. So I got a bunch of candles. Um, I'm going to take some of them and put them in my uh, bucket for Christmas stocking stuffers. And then the rest, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to light one here in a minute. Um, so that's the end for today's Advent vlog. And tomorrow, maybe a longer one or whenever it goes up. I'm gonna get two up in a row for sure, but the next one, I'm going to start setting up my sewing room and I think I'll just take you along and that'll be part of my um, Vlogmas for that day. So that may be tomorrow's because I desperately need to get my sewing room set up. The other thing I need to do is get a Christmas tree up because we are on December 2nd and I still don't have a Christmas tree. I have nothing Christmassy except the four stockings right here. And I have a little spray on my front door. So it's hard to move during the holidays and also renovate. Okay, see you soon, hopefully tomorrow.